it's great. I think it's uh, not something we take for granted for sure. I know a lot of teams don't have the, the luxury of coming in and being able to play in front of a passionate fan base like this in a venue that we have across the street here across the river. But um, for us, it's about keeping our head down, getting into this camp in the right way and getting out of it what we need to to feel confident as we start this year. And, um, most importantly, solidifying a culture throughout this camp and making sure that we're competing in the right way and we're going for success. What do you need to kind of get accomplished during this camp? Obviously, with a brand new team, it might be a lot of stuff, but what, what do you think like your goal for the next four weeks is? I think keep it simple. Work hard, be nice, be a good teammate, be someone that uh, young guys can look to and established guys can you know feed off of and get the right amount of energy going in the right direction, I think. Um, preseason is a great opportunity. Not many teams are going into a similar situation like this where you're starting fresh and with a clean slate. Um, and that alone is incredibly energizing, and I think all the guys feel it, and days like this just solidify it. Mm -hmm. Mike Jacobs has talked a lot about, as he, built this as he built this team, kind of valuing guys that maybe other MLS clubs didn't value as much. Um, obviously, you're a guy that's coming from within MLS. Do you feel kind of feel that vibe where, where Mike – kind of said we, we value you at a greater level than other people do and what does that mean to you I guess? Uh, it means the world to me to be somebody that you know a club looks to reach out to and make a part of such a project as this I mean mm -hmm. it's, it speaks volumes to to what they think of me and I couldn't be more humbled and honored for the opportunity I think like I said this isn't an opportunity or an experience that a lot of guys are having going into the start of this year this year so uh, I'm incredibly grateful and humbled like I said but energized more than anything to to be in a place that I'm happy to call home and looking forward to winning in these colors. What was going through your head when you were up on stage? Wow. <laughs> um, I mean, it's it's a unique experience. My first time in the building, didn't realize how big it was, didn't realize that there were three levels. I kept kind of looking up and seeing it. It was full of bodies, and the energy was uh, contagious, to say the least, and it's just so gratifying, so humbling to see all these people here and excited for what you're about to do. What do you think are realistic expectations for a team that's basically built from scratch, you know, jumping into MLS? Uh, win. Mm -hmm. I think it's pretty simple for me. I'm a pretty straightforward guy. If it was any other league, I think maybe it would be a taller order to step in and be super competitive and mm -hmm. expect, you know, accolades and uh, win things and trophies right away. But mm -hmm. this is MLS, I think, you know could look around the league and pick a group of random 11 guys any week and they could have a chance to win a game, let alone a team that's put together the way Mr. Jacobs has put it together and this club has approached it. Um, I think we have a lot of guys here for the right reasons, looking to do the right things. And for us, it's just the first step to get down to training camp and to put this first shift in and to come back and know that we're going to be in the thick of it right away and lining up across some 11 other guys that want to win. That's it. Mm -hmm.